Okay. Thank you so much, Dr. Forrester, for agreeing to talk with me today. And I know that you just wrote this book, Banksy, The Man Behind the Wall. Mm -hmm. I was wondering if you could tell me a little bit about how Banksy does his graffiti art. Mm -hmm. um, Banksy is um, one of the premier graffiti artists in the world. He travels the world to spread a message. And he does it under cover of night or in lonely alleyways where people don't go very often, but he wants his art to be seen. So he does put his art often in places that are very, very conspicuous. And, and if he doesn't get the message out, who will? Why, why do you think that the message is so important? Why do you think that this art is not vandalism, that it's art? Some people consider graffiti as vandalism. I don't because the message is more important than the building. People are more important than objects. Buildings are objects. Fences are objects. Um, whatever Banksy wants to put his message on is the idea of look what we're doing to our society. Look how we're handling um, each other as a society. What is wrong? What is right? So he brings up these questions in public in a space that's not a beautiful space to begin with. It's usually an old building that's tattered, torn, or in it's in a poverty-stricken area um, where the people can see. He brings it to light. Look, this is poverty. This is ugly. We need to do something.